these carriers can use the stone to mow down entire civilizations like wheat in a field. There's a little pee coming out of me right What's going now? on, moviegoers? So if you're to the channel, my name is Christian, and welcome to Zero Productions. You guys, The Eternals hits theaters November 2020 next year. And I am so thrilled to see this juggernaut of a cast, this juggernaut of characters in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. We're basically talking gods when we're talking about the Eternals. And I am so excited to see what more they have to offer. They start shooting this film this year. This year, and we most, probably, most likely we're gonna be getting a trailer within, like I say, February of next year. Even, maybe even possibly January. And of course, it's going to be attached, like the full long trailer is going to be attached with Black Widow. Um, but we got some concept art released for the film. And boy, oh boy, it, this excites me. It's Eternals. We see our first glimpse of the Celestials in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Now, we saw a little bit of them in the Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 1, if you remember that particular scene with, uh, oh boy, oh my God, I forgot his name. I'm drawing a blank. Not the Grandmaster. I forgot his brother's name. Oh my God, hold on. Where's this Funko Pop? Not around. Oh my, this is gonna kill me. I totally forgot his name. Whatever, anyways, when he was explaining the Infinity Stones, they showed you guys a glimpse of the Celestials. But in this concept art, we see more of the Celestials, obviously, that will be taking place in the Eternals film. And let me say, they are massive, huge. Just look at the scale of these characters. Look, look where their knees are. They're pretty much above the clouds. I can't wait to see the history behind the Eternals and the history behind the Celestials. Because obviously the Celestials created the Eternals as well, but also created the, the, the Deviants as well. So I can't wait to get all the backstory, especially on all the characters that we're gonna be getting in this movie. Athena, Icarus, Kingo, Makari, Phantos, Gilgamesh, Ajax, and Sprite slash Piper. All these characters we will be getting, you guys. I am so excited to see first looks, costume designs. It is going to be massive. And how it ties particularly in to the MCU until, until 2000, 2025. Like how it plays into today's role. Now it's going to be taken from the Jack Kirby era, not the Neil Gaiman's. So I got to go out and try to find the Jack Kirby e Eternals. Got to find it somewhere. I'm pretty sure I can find it somewhere online. I just, I like to own my comics. I like to own my graphic novels. And I hate reading on Kindles. I hate reading comics online. It's just not for me. But by all means, if I have to, I will. You know what I mean? But I'm excited. I can't wait to see all the colors they use. More from the Celestials. Like, it's, this is going to be big. People don't realize the Eternals is going to be huge. Like, big going forth into the MCU. Massive. So I can't wait to hear more plot details and things of that nature. And I can't wait to see, you know, Angelina Jolie as, you know, Athena. It's going to be pretty fucking awesome. And Icarus 2, I'm so ready, you guys. But post your comments down below. You guys, let me know what you guys think about this concept art for the Eternals with the Celestials. And what particular part do you think that the Eternals will have in the MCU going further? Post your comments down below, you guys. And thank you for taking time today for us to see Productions. Peace.